Hi darlings, how are you? This is going to be for my Pisces. And this is going to be a message for whenever you receive. I hope you guys are doing well and taking care of yourselves. So let's see what messages we have for you. I will be using my guardian angel messages tarot. And that's the only deck I'm using. So Pisces, this is for you. The five of earth. You're worrying about money. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, you got some worries where money is concerned. This, this is temporary, okay? This work, this kind of worry is just temporary, all right? It's the mindset of lack. You just feel like you don't have. Maybe, maybe it's just right this moment. But I need you to look around you and see all that you do have, all right? We got the renewal card, self-reflection, well, self-evaluation and reflection. I'm trying to see if y'all can see the cards. Okay. Um, this is about going within and doing some self-evaluation, looking at things, getting rid of the guilt, healing, forgiving yourself, forgiving people. It's all for you, you know, because at the end of it all, you are the one who benefits. You feel revitalized. You feel lighter. So whatever it is that you're going through, you got to do some self-evaluation, um, okay? There's something you're going to figure out, and it'll change that feeling. You got the page of water here. This is about intuition. This is about jealousy. <laughs> this is about listening to yourself. All right, and you're very intuitive. You also might have a little jealousy around you or within you. Just don't make it cause problems. The page of water. Then we have the queen of earth. Now this could be an earth energy, Pisces, that is in your in the past here. This could be, or maybe this in the past you felt pretty balanced financially and now you're feeling worried because things are ch have changed somewhat something changed in your environment if not this could be a virgo a taurus or a capricorn this energy was a very stable energy for you all right and that's the queen of earth she's usually the money manager maybe you were taking care of money you know back then you know taking care of things and you you're very magical listen to me this feeling here that you have is temporary. Please believe that. All right? You got possibilities and you need to believe in yourself. I can't believe in you for you. All right? So it starts with self. It starts with you. So you got the magician here. That's, you got all the resources within you. You're magical. Numbers don't like me to talk about magic. You heard how they behaving? <laughs> <laughs> but you you have manifestation powers, okay? You're very gifted. You're very gifted. So don't you second guess yourself. You, you're crafty. You're good with your hands. You got a good mind on you. You can figure things out. Start creating things, okay? Start creating. You got the six of water here. Um, the six of water is about memories. You're having some thoughts about the past. I don't know if you're thinking about, you know, when things were really good or whatever. But if you look around you, you will see things are really good, okay? So you're thinking about the past. And they're happy thoughts. It's not sad thoughts. You're just like, you know, nostalgia. But darling, there's something coming towards you pretty fast here. I don't know what it is. But something's coming fast. You gave me goosebumps on this side. Maybe some revelation is going to be coming. Something is going to be revealed to you very fast. 
It's going to bring you some good fortune. Like I said, you're, you, you are magical. Okay, you have the gift of intuition. You're very creative. You can get yourself out of any situation financially. This is temporary. All right, don't doubt yourself. Don't doubt yourself. You got the wheel. That's about good fortune, progress, luck, change. The four of air, you're deep in thought, but actually it's like more like a taking a break kind of thought you know um it's just relaxing you're just relaxing and you're thinking about stuff maybe you're thinking about everything that was revealed to you then we have the knight of earth we have the ace of air and we have the four of earth the knight of earth is about slow and steady pace you know financially i mean things are coming it, it's slow and it's steady okay um, it's about you being very responsible and very organized. The Ace of Air is about clarity, having mental clarity, inspiration, communication. Maybe this communication you're waiting for or you're thinking about. And then you got the Four Earths. Now, the Four Earths could mean that you're holding on to some finances that you don't need to hold. You know, maybe you're holding it tight, tight, tight. Don't be so tight, okay? Yes. You might, don't use the word broke either. You ain't broke, all right? You're just spending right now on the things that you need, not the things you want, which is fine, all right? Then we got the chariot, we got the emperor, and we got the two of earth. Okay, so something is coming fast. Stability now. It might be in the form. Ah, I don't know. This, this energy is an older energy, okay? Not decrepit and old, you know, but they're more maybe father-like or it could be romantic, depending on your age. But um, there is something coming, and it's about stability. Um, it's the emperor. That could be an Aries energy. This is a fire energy. But think about it. it I got the two earths next, and so watch your step, okay? Because usually to me, like fire and water, that outs each other, you know? So just think about, about that. You know, you want to be with somebody who's going to enhance you, you know? Not nobody who's going to douse. Or who you going to douse their fire or they going to, you know, make you feel. You know what I mean? So just think about it. That's how I think about signs and stuff like that. So we got the chariot. We got the emperor. You got to watch your step with this, with this energy. Or maybe you're going to. No, this is the way I'm going to say it. This energy is coming fast. Stability. But you need to watch your step. If this is an actual person, you need to watch your step with this person. You are feeling a little off balance financially. And that's, you know, you're going to have stability. There is a little conflict here. Um, there's something being built for you. Now, I have the five of air, which you might have made a couple of mistakes along the way. But, hey, who's perfect? You know what I'm saying? Really and truly, who is perfect? There ain't no perfect person. So don't you worry yourself about anything. Um, the five of air can also mean conflict, but it to me is a conflict in regards to how you're feeling financially. Okay, and then we got the um, we got the queen of air, which is about, which is talking about you. This could be energy. This could be a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius in your environment. But if not, you are very you brilliant. You got experience. You can do this. And we got the three of earth. There's something being built where finances are concerned. You just got to believe in you. And you got to be able to do this. You got to believe in the possibilities, okay? Don't limit yourself, all right? So you got the five of air. You got the queen of air. And you got the three of earth. And one more card. And then the page of earth. You're going to be having some messages. You're going to get some messages in regards to finances. The finances and the stuff that you've been thinking about. You're going to have a decision to make. And there will be a new financial beginning for you. Remember now, like I said, it's, life is a little up and down. But you got to go with it. Don't stay in those down moments too long. Remember, we, 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 we thrive and we give off energies and frequencies. So it's give off positivity okay and we attract positivity i love you guys you take care of yourselves and we will chat soon okay don't you give up and get out of that mindset stop worrying the more you worry about money the more you chase it away i love you bye